Hey guys, welcome back to the Simple Ground Homestead. I'm here giving you that long-awaiting, long-awaited update on my batteries and how they're working out. Now, you guys have been waiting for so long because I've been working on making a very thorough video about the whole thing. Um, I wanted to take you inside the house, give you a breakdown of what I'm using there and how my whole system fits together, the design that I've done. But in the process, uh, I've worked things out to get my solar panels and the solar panel setup. So charge controller, everything else that's going to go into this box, it's all coming and it's happening months sooner than I expected. I was thinking springtime, but it all came together. Uh, I, I guess I just asked the question when you know what what do i need what is it going to look like and the number came in a lot lower than i expected and so i'm like let's go for it so anyway that's all coming in and i figure why do it twice um but if i wait even longer somebody might come and throw me off a cliff because you guys have been waiting for a long time to know what's going on here so without further ado uh, I'm going to show you my batteries here. The cables came in and I've connected them all up and you know the long story short it works great. I'm getting that that other side working and it's happy. Uh, it's like I've doubled, doubled my battery capacity. It's pretty sweet. So a few of you have reached out to me and helped me through this process. That was a really quick show and tell, but I need to tell you a little bit about the story behind it. Um, some of you reached out with concern, uh, very just concern. <laughs> some of you reached out with a lot of experience, and that's what helped me move forward with the second set of cables. Uh, first of all, a good test that I ran was as I was charging, I pulled out my tester and the connected side read at the charge rate, um, you know, between 28, 29 volts, right? 28, 30 volts. The other side still read the normal. So um, making sure my numbers are right there in my head because I, I was actually testing it at the 2 volt, right, you know, anyway. It was 2.8 and 2.0, 2.1 on the other side. There you go. That, that gave me a pretty clear indicator that they were, in fact, two separate batteries. Um, the actual company still wasn't very clear, but I had another company uh, out of Australia that I believe contact me and helped me through it. And they gave me some pretty clear indication that I would be 100% safe doing this and that made me feel really good that was the that was the driving force behind it all backwood solar they were super good two hundred eighty dollars worth of cables maybe I shouldn't have said that for free they just send them my way um, cables probably aren't the optimal way of doing this but I can't complain it's gonna work just fine and you know the mistake was fixed so nothing to complain about on my end. Uh, hopefully I haven't ruined, you know, used <laughs> half the battery disproportionate to the other half and, and hurt things somehow, but we'll cross that bridge as we move forward. So yeah, everything is working well. As you can see here, I have great things coming. Uh, I'm really excited to get these solar panels, which is kind of crazy. I'm, I'm a little solar panel adverse. But it's going to be really cool to have things charging when the sun's shining, don't you think? And, uh, you know, to avoid boring you even longer, I'll end this video. But just so you know, um, I have a dog sniffing my, the back of my leg. Just so you know, everything is coming. You're going to have some good things uh, soon. Thanks for watching and thanks for taking this journey with me on Simple Ground. Here's my dog.
Ivy, say hello. Ivy. Ha, <laughs> ha,